After watching this video, you're gonna be able to turn simple requests like this, along with deep, rich context on your business and brand into actual human level copywriting content, emails, social posts, video scripts, video sales letters, landing pages, ads, the sky's the limit, right? So this doesn't look like your typical chat GPT output because I've been using AI since 2021, building AI copywriting and fully automated content systems and more on that in just a bit. And basically, I'm going to show you how to create this deep, rich context document around your business, brand, target persona, products and services, and all the nuts and bolts that you got to train and teach the AI to actually have context around your business. Because like, just like with a human copywriter or social media manager, like they're going to need context to produce all of these assets and content types, right? You got to feed the engine, right? So how do we do that? We will basically want to use a bunch of different prompts that I've crafted here and that you're going to get access to in our, inside our school community. So if you're watching this anywhere outside, then make sure to join now. That's where you get access to all the source prompts, templates, frameworks, everything. And once you're in, just respond to my message and I'm going to unlock the classroom for you with the resource where you can get these prompts right here. And here's just some more samples that I've been creating and writing using this. And I didn't write any of this. This is literally just copy pasted straight out of our system, which allows us to do all of this fully automated, by the way. So I've just shown you that context document, which was static, right? So in our system, we can dynamically choose and create new audiences, right? So if I was going to target coaches, I could create a whole briefing on that, break down all the psychological aspects and uh, things I want to train the AI on to create actual good content along with my products and services. But again, you can also do this the manual way and just paste it into Google Doc, right? So that's where you want to get these prompts right here and basically go to webinar resources. And you want to get this brand context prompt and basically just copy it and go right inside of ChatGPT and you want to feed it the context, right? So this is the normal old way of doing it. You basically copy and paste stuff into here. But if you've been paying attention and watching some of my content, then Obviously, again, you got to have the foundations in place, right? So if you don't have an actual framework and strategy for creating and distributing your content, then nothing's going to do any good, right? Make sure to watch my video on that. We're just going to teach you the foundation that you need to actually break down all of this stuff, right? So if you want to create good content, you got to be able to really read the minds of your target personas, right? Because then no matter what topic and subtopics you actually feed the AI, it's going to be able to create actual banger content for you. Right. And that's the idea. So we want to basically create that deep, rich context. Again, if you haven't joined yet, make sure to do so. That's where you're going to get access to all the source. And if you've been paying attention, you can actually automate all of this as well. Right. So whether you're using tools like Zapier, Make and 8N, you can basically connect these prompts into the system and chain them together. So basically it feeds the context into the prompts. Right. So that way you do not need to manually do this. However, we're going to start off doing this the manual way. And I'm just going to go and grab some context from, I'm, I'm into gardening, actually, permaculture. There's this really cool course here on permaculture. And I'm just going to do control A, control C, copy the whole thing, and literally just paste that into the out brackets here, right? So now I just paste, and this is going to now create the context on the brand level, right? And this is level one, right? We want to have context on the brand. We want to have context on the target personas. And we also want to have context on the products and services. And obviously this is going to take some time, which is why I actually built a little mini workflow for you guys, right? So again, there's going to be a full guide inside the school that's going to be linked, right? And that's going to teach you how to do this, but this does it fully automated. So you just feed it one input of the context. I'm just going to paste in the same stuff here. And now I'm going to hit run. And this is going to fully automate it now, generate this for me, right? It's going to first generate context on the business then on the products and services, then it's going to figure out what are the three most likely personas for this business. And it's going to generate persona one, persona two, and persona three. And this is going to take a minute, but while this is loading, let's take a look at chats with the old <laughs> manual way here. And as you see here, we got a bunch of context that would be highly valuable to create content, right? And if you don't have this context here, then how the hell would the AI be able to make anything good? So I'm just going to tell it to expand on it here because, uh, again, I don't have control over the temperature and the thinking capabilities here as if I would through the API where I set all of this to high and max tokens. So this is going to generate quite some context here and we're going to have pages worth of stuff 
So now I ask it to basically go more into depth here and we should have some pretty good context on the brand level, right? But again, that is just level one. Ideally, we want to have context on all different products and services, all of the different target personas or audiences, whatever you want to call it. Or if you want to be full on crazy, you can even feed it real life competitor data, right? So that's where we've set up a full on automated flow that scrapes my entire niche on YouTube and uh, I can feed this into my AI system here as well right that's a little bit of beyond today's video here though right so let's just see what we get here right so now we have the brand context awesome and hey this is gonna be good stuff to feed the ai with to actually create good content now right and this is just on the brands right we go much much deeper breaking down the actual target personas as well as the products and service details right so this is going further into the details here but again, that was just step one here on the business, right? We want to have this for different personas and we want to basically expand and synthesize all of that. So in just about a second here, I'm going to have the full context document for this business here, right? And I can use that along with my copywriting guidelines here to really create anything. So for this, if you want to have access to this, send me a DM and uh, if I'm generous, I'm going to shoot you the link. But uh, I ask you to not share this out anywhere because this is 61 pages worth of manually scraped and dissected and analyzed uh, actual knowledge base items here on juicy copywriting info. Because if I now take this and just copy it and I go over to a little context generator and actually get the final output here, I can now create anything. So again, basically what happened here is we basically generated the first prompt, just like we just did in chat. And then the output of this, we would feed into the next prompt, right? So now we have the context on the brand, which we generated in the previous prompt. And we want to feed that into this next prompt here, along with additional context, right? Again, all of that you could do manually and copy and paste and copy and paste and copy and paste, or you use the very basic automated workflow I've built for you guys here using make.com. And again, there's going to be a full guide on how to set it up and you can run it pretty much for free. This is going to cost very, very little money to run here and basically generate this automated. However, imagine now this is just scratching the surface, right? This is the actual brand creation setup and one of the hundreds of actual live automations we have part of our system that helps us churn out human level content at scale, right? So the, this has been an absolute monster that we've built here over the past year. And again, if you're watching this right now here and there's a video, uh, the a link to book a call with me below this video, I highly suggest you to do that because right now I'm looking for people to, to basically test drive this for free, right? So you basically just hop on a call with me and I'm gonna give you a full demo that basically just like we did in chat here with a short little briefing at the beginning of the video here, I can now give it the exact same briefing and it has all of that background context, right? It knows about my audiences. It knows about my products and services. It has the brand context and I can now fully automate it, generate any content format imaginable. Here, I literally took Dan Coe's top performing uh, Twitter threads and turned that into a prompt for me to help turn ideas into Twitter threads. And there's really, the sky's the limit. And this is why I'm looking for your feedback right now. And I'd love to chat with you and to test this out for, again, your business, one of your client's businesses, and actually have you use this here to generate some higher level content at scale, whatever you wanna, wanna do, right? So at this point, we should have the final document ready. Let's just get this right here. And again, for you, this is going to be in a neat little Google Doc. This is just the MVP workflow here before the video actually goes live. But as you see here, this is all the context we have now. So if I just go create a new document real quick and paste that in, we now have 16 pages and that's not even normal text formatting. Let's just apply that 27 pages worth of context on this permaculture gardening course, right? So if I now took this along with the copywriting guidelines, I can have it create anything. Right, so let's just paste that right here. That is all the context on the business. And now the copywriting guidelines, let's paste those in as well. And now I can pretty much write anything, right? So now I don't even need prompts at this point anymore. However, again, if you wanna really dial this shit up, then obviously you're gonna have specific prompts for each content format, right? So that's where, again, if you follow a prompt engineering framework that I taught you in one of my recent videos, so if you haven't watched that, definitely check it out. I even got clients that haven't watched this. What is wrong with you? 
Um, so that's going to teach you the framework we use to basically create prompts for any use case. And where if you now combine this rich context with laser specific prompts, you're going to get insane outputs. And I've got a little bit of a prompt builder here that you guys can test out to build those prompts. But then also, of course, again, if you join our community book call with me, I can unlock some of these other prompts for you for any other content types that you guys might be interested in. As well as, of course, inside of our system, we have shit ton of different prompts, even what we like to call frameworks, which are actual, um, let me show you real quick, actual frameworks that you can rewrite or have the AI rewrite. And this is where I could, again, bulk generate this now, click the button. I don't want to push, push it. That's going to cost us money here. But again, it's going to generate the content in any format imaginable, right? So again, I'd love to give you a demo of this here, but let's actually do this the chat GPT old way here, right? So let's uh, just manually talk to it real quick here. All right, so I just told it, write an email sequence promoting the next launch of our PDC, and I'm going to press enter. And the PDC, that's the name of the product, the permaculture, whatever it's called, I don't know. So it's now basically going to go through. It's going to analyze all of the copywriting guidelines and frameworks that I gave it. And on that in just a second here, this is some next level shit as well. But right here, it's going to now analyze all of that and craft the sequence because of all the context I gave it. And if I just scroll through, you see this, this is 60 pages plus 27 pages worth of context that I fed the AI here to now come up and create the final content here. And uh, this is where now we get some actual juice here. So if you read these here, obviously there might be some things you might need to change, but look at all of these deep, rich contexts and understanding around the offer, trying to hit the right nerves with the target market, their actual pain points and desires as well, right? Because look at the level of depth that we now have here. I'm just generating this in Markdown here so I can show you in a clean way. But you see all of the things that are broken down here by the AI and this prompt chain that we had set up here, which basically fed all of these outputs into one another, right? So it generates the business context, puts that into the product and service prompt, and then feeds these into one another, right? So again, this is just, just barely scratching the surface of what is actually possible with true automation and systems, right? Again, right here with our AI content machine that we've built, this allows us to churn out human level content at scale. We've basically built a full on, like the most insane AI content infrastructure imaginable. And I would love to get your feedback on this. So again, if there's still a link to book a call with me that says demo, then definitely make sure to book it with me. We're going to run you through the actual process. So if you want to get a full context document like this here, I'm just going to scroll through. You can pause and read if you want then. Again, make sure to join our community linked in or around below this video and book a call with me. I'm going to run your context through our system, which is not just going to take this surface level info like I did today here, just taking the website. It's actually also going to pull all of your competitors' data, all of their content, what they're posting, along with doing keyword re research analysis and a whole bunch of other awesome things, right? So I've just shown you, what I've just shown you here today is literally just scratching the surface, right? We've got workflows that are scraping literally, like this is data from all of my competitor channels. I know exactly all of their proven videos, what's working, what's not working, have all of the data and I can feed that live into my AI content system to create fully automated content at scale. So it's insane what is possible. Uh, if you're interested in using a system like this, make sure to book a call with me or again, either way, I would love to get your feedback and run you through this for free and basically have you create this full document along with any other content that you need. So again, book that call with me, join the community and I'll see you guys on the other side. Take care.